Question number 5 says that in question 4, point C is called a midpoint of line segment AB. We have to prove that every line segment has one and only one midpoint. So let's have a line segment AB and let's say that it has got two midpoints, midpoint C and midpoint D. Assuming first that C is the midpoint of AB, we write AC equals BC. Now adding AC on both sides we get AC plus AC equals BC plus AC. So on addition that gives us 2 times AC equals BC plus AC from the figure can be seen that is equal to AB. So we write equals AB. That gives us that AC equals half of AB. Let's take this as equation 1. Now, the second assumption can be that there is a second midpoint, midpoint D. So, in this case, we can write that AD equals BD. Now, let's add AD on both sides. So, we get AD plus AD equals BD plus AD. So on addition we get that as 2 times AD equals BD plus AD can be seen from the figure is equal to AB. So I write 2 AD equals AB. That implies that AD is equal to half of AB. So that can be taken as equation 2. So now from equation 1 and equation 2, we can conclude that AC is equal to AD. Therefore, C coincides with D. Now, by axiom 4, we know that things which coincide with one another are equal to one another. Therefore, a line segment has only one midpoint. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.